Breaking news on ABC 17 News at 10 right now. Police are investigating after a woman is attacked on a Columbia Trail. ABC 17's Deborah Kendrick joins us live from the MKT Trail at the Forum Access. And Deborah, what do we know so far? Well, Marissa and Joey, I actually just spoke with Columbia Police Department to get an update for you. And as of right now, they are searching for one suspect. He's a white male. That's all the information they can give me right now. He is potentially considered armed and dangerous after he struck a woman that was on the trail here earlier today around 8 p.m. Now, all we know of the woman is that she was 26 years old and that she was by herself and a witness called called in for emergency help. Now, this is some video that you're seeing on your screen from earlier today. Um, what we know about her is that she's being treated with non-life-threatening injuries at a local hospital. We don't know exactly what she was struck with. Police would not give us that information at this time, uh, but police say they are about two hours into this investigation. They have detectives on scene trying to piece everything together. And if, like I said earlier, they are still looking for that one male suspect that is still on the run. What they know is that he ran in the eastbound direction after the incident happened earlier today. Now, um, this all comes just one day after I actually spoke with the city about how safe our parks and trails are after two women on the east coast were murdered. Our parks and trails are as safe as any place in the city. You know, they're probably more safer than if you were going to a Columbia Mall parking lot or any parking lot. Now, I spoke with some runners and some trail goers here just earlier when the scene was happening, and they were very shocked after what they found out. They said they run this trail oh, every day. They bring their, uh, you know, dogs and they bring their families here. And so, by, but just by what's been happening, they said they're going to be very uh, much more cautious by being on this trail as everyone is just kind of in a shock right now. The Columbia police say they're not going to release any more information overnight unless they catch the suspect. So if we get that information, we'll be sure to update you either on air or online. Live in Columbia. Deborah Kendrick, ABC 17 News. Thank you, Deborah. And of course, we will check back in with Deborah if we do confirm any more information in this newscast. In other